Okay, so because not many people have Photoshop, I'm going to show you how to make LUTs in Panzoid instead. Uh, <clears throat> if you have if you have Photoshop, just watch the other tutorial. It's easier than this. So here's how you do it in Panzoid. You want to go to this website here, and I'll leave the link in description. You need to download this image here. You're going to save the image. I'll put it on my desktop then you want to go to Panzoid Preview or whatever you want to make the CC in or the LUT in and you just want to import the image put it over your scene bear in mind this is going to be a one frame thing so it doesn't matter like where you put it go to sequence do the same resolution as the picture so this is 512 by 512 then you want to make a new adjustment layer and you can Let's let's uh, change the saturation. Let's make it less saturated. Let's make our LUT. Uh, let's shift the colors over. So that's how our LUT's going to look, okay? So now you just want to render it as a single frame. And then over here, you want to choose the file you just made. That. Open. Convert. Give it a sec. And you can download the LUT here, so it will open up a WinRAR. What I'm going to do is just put it on my desktop here. And now we can test this. Okay, so what I'm going to do here, I'm going to go four frames over, turn that adjustment layer off so you can see the difference here. And we're going to make a new adjustment layer for the actual LUT. I'm going to crop it down to here. So I'll switch between the two, okay? So you can see that this actually works. Go to LUT, choose the file from our desktop. Wow, it's like it works in Panzoid as well. There you go, Leco.